What is going on guys? It is Jay. As you know, if you clicked on this, we are gonna I'm gonna be talking about seven uh, cardinal rules to live your life by to make you the happiest person you could be. So the first rule is make peace with your past so it won't disrupt your future. Hold on a second, let me explain. So what I mean by make peace with your past is you can't change it, right? Yesterday's history, tomorrow's a mystery, live in the now. Always live in today. There's nothing, <laughs> birds are flying everywhere. There's nothing you can do about your past. It's your past. It happens, some people have good past, some people have bad past, some people have things they would love to forget, but that's how life is. All you have to do, all you can do is make peace with what happened and live in the now. Mainly what that one is for is for relationships because a lot of people won't get into a relationship. They could have the perfect person in front of them. They could everything right, but they're just afraid, right? You're never gonna, I mean, speaking from past relationships, you're never gonna get the apology you wanted if something bad happened to you. You're never gonna get it. All you can do is make peace with yourself make peace with that person you know that's uh it's hard it truly is but once you get to be able to do that your life will be so much better because you're not always looking for that I'm sorry I'm sorry I did this I'm sorry this happened you're not looking for it I'll never <laughs> there's one apology that I'll never get and I've came to accept it so Always just make peace with what you can make peace with and just let it go. It sucks, it really does, I get it. But that is tip number one. Tip number two, coming in a little bit. All right guys, so cardinal rule number two. What people think of you is none of your damn business. I know you're saying, well Jay, you're in a, you're in a parking lot. There's no one around you. Who cares? Let me explain. guys so I am in the middle of my city where I live at there's people all around so one thing I just wanted to let you guys know and the one thing that I have is behind me I was in the army some of you guys don't know that some of you guys do um, this is a very special place to me because it's just a commemorative everything I'm sure you saw from the little b-roll before it is a thing and I'm sorry if the traffic is really loud but so I just wanted to come out here just let you guys know like who cares what people think of me? There's people staring at me all over, over here. Who cares? They're not doing what I'm doing. Maybe they'll see this one day and, and be like, oh, this is what this guy was doing. Just trying to motivate people. One thing you cannot do is don't be afraid. Don't be afraid of people. Everybody's awkward in their own little way. Everybody's awkward in one way or another. I know I don't seem that awkward, you know? But I'm awkward as hell. <laughs> so, hopefully, so, we are gonna to get to rule number three here in one second. All right guys, so the next, next cardinal rule is time heals almost everything. Just give it time. Let me explain. One of the hardest things for us to do as uh, younger people right is believe that everything 
that everything will eventually fade, right? Like heartbreak will always fade. Everything, pain, pain only lasts for a certain amount of time. Everything, so literally just give it time. You will eventually, <laughs> I'm so dizzy. You will eventually get that obstacle. You will get over it and you will be able to persevere more than you ever think you will. You wanna do it? All right, we'll go slow, okay? No, fast. You wanna go fast? All right, we'll go fast. <laughs> Little man just jumped on here with me. <laughs> All right, be careful. <laughs> All right, so we are gonna go to uh, number four, I think. I think that's where we're at right now. We'll say number four. <laughs> All right, guys, so rule number four is no one's in charge of your happiness except you. Let me explain. Alright guys, so what I mean by that is don't let anybody have the key to your happiness because if somebody has the key to your happiness, they can make you happy and not happy. If you are the only owner of the key to your happiness, then you can be happy as much as you want. You can not be as happy as you can be as miserable as you want if you if you so desire. One of the a good thing that I heard from this guy, he knew I was going through a divorce and everything, and he saw like I was down and he's like, Why does she have the keys to your happiness? because she's the one that's making you miserable right now. So why don't you just take it back? You make yourself happy. It's basically self-motivation, self-happiness. If you're happy with yourself, then you can't. no one can make you unhappy with you. And that's one thing I always, always try to live by is I, I am the creator of my own happiness. So with that being said, let's go to number five. Big hand five. <laughs> See you guys in a second. All right, guys. Tip number five: Don't compare your life to anybody else's. Let me explain. So people always want to compare themselves to other people, but at the same time, you don't know what their struggle was to get where they're at. You don't know what their what happened or anything like that. So your journey is gonna be different than their journey, who's gonna be different than their journey. Everybody's journey to success or to anything that you want in life is gonna be different. So never compare yourself. Create your own path. That's always a, uh, a good thing to live by, is always just create your own path. So I'll come back to you with number six. Okay. Did you close the door? Number seven, don't think too much. Stop thinking so much, don't overthink things. Let me explain. Sometimes you will not have all the answers, right? And it's not the worst thing in the world. You don't have to know everything. You don't have to know why people do things or why certain things happen. That's making peace with being able to realize that you're not gonna have all the answers is an amazing feeling. So like, and the answers, the answers will come when you least expect it. And in relationships or in life in general, if you, something happens and you're like, why? Why, 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 why this, why that? Don't ask, the, don't, I mean, sometimes you're just never gonna know. But then you'll understand why later on down the road. So, we've got the six, we're about to hit number seven, and I hope you guys enjoy it.
So the last and final cardinal rule that I'll have is to smile. Smile as much as you can. Let me explain. <laughs> guys so the last thing that I wanted to tell you was just smile have a good time it makes life so much easier it puts everybody else at ease around you and this acoustic suck um, but that's that's one thing if you've watched my channel for any amount of time from my first video to this is your first video watching I will always do my best to smile in every single situation I mean even when I tore my ACL on video you could still, even afterwards, I was still smiling. I mean, hell, the next day my girlfriend got me a, my favorite team Super Bowl shirt. So, like, it's a, one thing that I will always do through adversity, through everything, is smile. So, those are the seven cardinal rules, cardinal principles, if you will, that, uh, that I try to live by. And, uh... Yeah, so if you got any enjoyment out of this video, if you liked me, so consider subscribing. Um, share this, I think it's over here, over there, over here. Share that to, uh, to your social medias, let everybody know. Um, and if you liked the video, obviously hit that like button. Duh, helps me out, helps you out. Hopefully you can see us blow up. But I appreciate you guys watching, staying through this video, and uh, my girlfriend for, being weird with me right now but have a good rest of the day guys and uh always try to live by the principles and i'm definitely putting that pit video of uh her falling right there. we're doing an engagement exercise okay <laughs> good all right guys peace out